pin motion interface is a multifunction component that has the string pass through it before routing it to the setting platform. The PMI, short for pin motion interface, performs two functions. With the movement of the string, the PMI indicates that a bowling pin has fallen over and through a brake mechanism controls whether or not a pin will be lowered to the pin deck when the string wagon moves toward the front of the machine. A pin is prevented from being lowered to the pin deck via a solenoid contained within the PMI. When the solenoid is energized, a string brake pinches the string, prohibiting it from moving through the PMI and setting on the pin deck. The string is pinched by the string brake to hold the string, and in order to release the string, the string wagon pulls the string rearward, freeing the string brake to rotate downward and free the string allowing the string to move. The PMI's brake mechanism may become jammed for a couple of different reasons. Most likely, either the string length was shortened and not compensated for, or the string brake solenoid switch was adjusted upward, engaging the string brake solenoid prematurely. Due to these or other scenarios, the PMI may become jammed, not allowing the string brake to rotate downward. When this happens, it may become necessary for the technician to manually free the PMI string brake. Before the PMI is unjammed, we must first verify the position of the string brake solenoid switch. The string brake solenoid switch should not be positioned all the way in the up position. It should be positioned more towards the middle of the adjustment range. After freeing the PMI brake, the string should be adjusted along with verifying the string brake solenoid switch adjustment. Both the string and string brake solenoid switch adjustments are located in the string pin service manual. To manually free the PMI string brake, use standalone 2 ball or standalone 3 ball to set all pins on the pin deck. Once the machine has set all the pins it can and the drive motor has stopped, we can turn power off to the pin setter. Remember, do not work on the pin setter without first removing power. Locate the string for the pin that is stuck and firmly grab it from the bottom. Pull consistently to the rear of the machine to attempt to free the string brake. If successful, the pin will descend to the pin deck when you release the string. If this method does not work, there is an alternative method. Standing on the lane in front of the machine will need to access the bottom of the PMI. When the stuck pin PMI is located, find the bottom of the string brake and use a rod or a screwdriver to push the string brake rearward, freeing it. The pin will fall to the pin deck. The PMI should be free now and the string adjustment and string brake solenoid switch adjustment can be made and the pin setter can be tested before placing it back in service.